The number of hate crimes against Muslims has skyrocketed. Well, Muslim Americans are already feeling the divide in their communities here at the home. The child was reciting an Islamic prayer as he boarded the New York City MTA bus. The driver heard the prayer and called the boy a terrorist Republican and ejected him from the bus. Donald Trump is facing heavy criticism after calling for a, quote, total and complete ban on Muslims entering the United States. Dr. Prabhjot Singh, who is Sikh and wears a turban and a beard, was attacked by multiple suspects who shouted anti-Muslim statements just before knocking him down and punching him numerous times in the face. The past few years, there have been an average of 12.6 hate crimes against Muslims in the U.S. each month. In this past month, 38 have been recorded, 18 of which happened after the San Bernardino shooting. protesters picketed a nearby mosque in Irving. In Virginia, tempers erupted at a meeting over building a mosque. Every one of you are terrorists, I don't care what you say. Now, authorities in Fort Wayne, Indiana, are investigating the murders of three young Muslims who were shot and killed execution style. In the wake of 9-11, hate crimes towards Muslim Americans and Muslim-looking Americans increased throughout the U.S. Cases of violence, Harassment and even murder were all reported in the weeks following the attacks. Unfortunately, these spikes of hate crime across the U.S. would not end with 9-11, but would continue with each subsequent terrorist attack in the years after 